U.S. Navy orders a halt in operations and a safety review of its Pacific-based 7th Fleet after two ship collisions in two months, the most recent between a U.S. warship and a commercial oil tanker near Singapore. A wide-scale search underway for 10 missing sailors. The USS John S. McCain has a badly damaged hull. Despite that, it was able to make it to a Singapore Navy Yard. CGTN's Ryan Meltzer reports from the Malaysian capital of Kuala Lumpur. The collision happened around 4.5 nautical miles off the southeast tip of Malaysia. But because it was near a tiny island claimed by Singapore and Malaysia, both countries say the accident happened in their territorial waters and that they are leading the search and rescue efforts. Singapore and Malaysia have deployed aircraft and sea vessels to search for the missing sailors in their respective zones, with Navy vessels from the U.S. and Indonesia also joining in the hunt. Four sailors who suffered non-life-threatening injuries were airlifted to Singapore for treatment. Experts say incidents like these are rare, but it's just over two months since another U.S. Navy destroyer was involved in a fatal collision with a merchant vessel. Malaysia's Coast Guard chief said the question of whose waters the accident occurred in must be secondary to efforts to find the missing sailors. Both Singapore and Malaysia enjoy regular and close military cooperation with the U.S. Ryan Meltzer, CGTN, Kuala Lumpur.